Hello there, Inconvenient Panda, back again for some more Casual Craft, Season 3, Episode 4, yeah! And if I've done my job correctly, this would have come out the same day as Episode 3, because that's what I said would happen, and I hope that's what's happened, unless I've forgotten, which is always a possibility. But what I need is I need some sand. I have to finish making my sterling engine. Hmm. Which is, uh... I don't, even, I don't need much sand. I just need it to make glass. And then I will need clay for bricks. Which I'll explain when they're sort of relevant. But luckily there's clay over here. Whoop. Another awesome thing about this texture pack is you can, you can see clay. It's, it's very different from the other textures. So, you can find it. And how do I have that... How do, how's that lag? I'm not playing on a server, that's just weird. Eh. Anyway. I just want to get a fair amount of this stuff. Probably should have made a shovel, but oh well. I don't even give a care! Mm. Nearly fell. Oh, Minecraft music. Yes. Yeah. Uh, let's get back. Yeah. Yeah. We're doing it. And I will set up. Oh, copper. Good. I will set up you to do you and you to do you with you and you. Wait. Uh, you. Is that, that going to be enough? So eight will give me two and that. Yeah. That's how many I need. So one glass. And we have a sterling engine. For which we need a redstone signal to activate. Which will be in the form of this lever. But a sterling engine is probably my favorite of the beginning engines. Because all you do is put coal in it. And it outputs power. I don't know what mod it's from, exactly, so I'm I'm sorry about that. S as far as I can tell, all these mods are together. I don't know anyone who plays with them separately. But, um, as you can see, it's a little complex. But, uh, we'll get into it. Well, I mean, this bit, I mean, it's actually not complex. You just put coal in there and then turn on a lever and it creates some power. <clears throat> I'll explain it a bit better later when I actually come to use it. Uh, need some glass. Uh, I mean, my bricks. My brick. Um, uh, gonna put that in there. That's one thing I need to find is a rubber tree. So I'll take that out for now. <coughs> Sorry, but uh, I'm gonna make a tree tap. And a tree tap will allow us to extract resin from rubber trees which we can then make into rubber which will be helpful for future purposes um i'm sure there was a rubber tree just over here a minute ago so i think that's it there yeah you can tell rubber trees apart because they have this weird stalk thing at the top of them. But what I'm going to do is... Oh, actually, that's what I'll make. I just thought of something cool. Uh, what I want to make is... Just a uh, cobblestone will do. A sickle! Yay! These things are so awesome, it hurts my brain. <laughs> Ow, my brain! My brain. Are you ready? How cool is that? No more of that, like, floating leaf crap when you knock down a tree. Nah, that's it. Leaves are gone, then you just chop the rest of it down with your axe. But I can't be bothered doing that right now. Because what I want to do is get a rubber tree sapling, because I sort of... You know, I died before and lost the original one. And this will just be uh, really the easiest way to do it. 
probably. Probably the easiest way. Now, I'm making this more difficult than it actually needs to be. But, uh, uh, you know, I'd like to think that's my style. Yeah. Alright. So. Bang. Just like that. And sickle. Yeah, sickle. Oh, there's one. Oh, there's two. There's three. That's actually really good. So, uh, they're usually a bit rare. But now what I want to get is it that thing. That is... Whoops. That is a resin spot. If I right click, I get... Sticky resin! Yay! But, uh... Now that I actually got those saplings, I don't really need this tree here. So what I might do is just chop the thing down. I don't need it. No, I'll just leave it. Might as well. It's not hurting anyone. Excuse me, leaves. <laughs> it's so cool. The other thing it does is, um... Yeah. It does that. And it does a fantastic job of it. It's so cool. Uh, it also takes out grass. You know when you've got, like, a large field covered in grass, you're like, man, I'd like to get rid of this tall grass. You just use these things. Sickles! So I'll try and find an example. Ah, like just here. Normally you'd have to go in and punch them one by one. Sort of annoying and time consuming. You just do that. You just do that. It's just... It's beyond awesome. You just don't understand, man. You just don't understand! Uh, I'm gonna plant some of this down. Try and get some sort of uh, what's it called? Reed? No, sugar cane. I don't know. I forget which one they call it now. But I want to get a, one of those farms going because paper will come very in handy later. Just mining up these potatoes, potatoes, yeah. Yes, potatoes. And I guess we'll plant carrots, potatoes, and wheat. And yeah, I guess that'll be it. Oop. Don't want to eat that yet. Get that planted. Yes, yes. My bricks are probably cooked by now, so. Yeah, one short. Oh well. And potatoes. I prefer carrots just because potatoes you gotta bake them before they do you any real good. And wheat's just always nice. And I might want to make a hoe. Might want to make a ho 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 I'll make a golden hoe. Yes, that's a waste of gold. I'm doing it. Oh, what a waste. <laughs> ah, good times. Should have made a diamond one. Oh well. Live and learn. Wow. Like 30 uses? Gotta be, gotta be shitting me. That's incredibly bad. And I didn't plant my seeds. Because I am what's called a noob. Why didn't you... Why didn't you hydrate? Buddy. I think I'll just hang out for a second and see what's up. Yeah. You cool? You cool? Alright, you cool. You cool? Yeah, you cool. You cool? Yeah, you, you cool. Yeah, you, yeah. Okay, he's cool. I think it's getting dark. All my villages are going inside. Yeah. I was right. Okay. Now we've got the bricks we need. So we need bricks. Yes. So I got uh clean up my inventory a bit. Foodstuffs. So like 
I don't know that. Seeds. Oak. It's rubber tree. I should plant those. I'll get to it. Uh, no. No, you're going in that one. Uh, so disorganized. Now, when I hang on to that, tools and stuff like that in there. Mm, aluminium. Don't really need that. Ah, oh, miscraft. That's what I was trying to think of. An appetite. More like crapitite. <laughs> no, it did. Uh, it's it's useful later. Don't worry about that. I want to put my coal in there. That I need to save. I just want to use cold coke. We'll do that. We'll do that. I'm sure what to build this place out of. Whether or not I should just... Should I just use cobblestone or... Is that too shit? Hmm. Hmm. What I could do is... Sort of half cheat a little bit. And get like an absolute butt ton of basalt real quick. Basalt cobblestone. Oh no. Hmm. I'll do it later. For now, it's just gonna be... It's just gonna be cobble. Now, I... Uh, I don't know what level I really want this at. Let's just go this level. Alright. So that's... 44. Okay. So what I'm gonna do... Uh, not that. I want... No. Alright, I'll pick the filler back up, jeez. I want that. Ah, probably a bit further back than that. Okay, we'll go there. We'll just run across at 336. And... Why is it... No! I don't want that. I want it to be normal. And you right click it to sort of activate it, so now these two are interacting, which is good. So, 44 at 66. So, I guess they're all do. So now they're interacting. Um, I'm absolutely starving. Come on, baked potato, do your job. You had one job. God. I'm going to click that just to be sure. Pretty sure you don't have to, but I don't know. Place down the filler, and what that'll do is it'll create a little boundary. That'll sort of show you the area it's going to fill while knocking off your little landmark things. So, you know, you can go pick them up if you want to save them. If you don't, if you don't care, then don't worry about it. But now that we've got the filler down, we have to put in a recipe for it. And the recipe I'm going to use is the filling recipe. It doesn't actually tell you. Oh, it's flattened. Okay. So you just click on it and it tells you. But what this will do is it'll make all this area at, well, it'll make it this level. So because it includes like the block height thing. So now the Sterling engine, I put that down. Some coal in there, and hopefully this works. I haven't actually tested this. I just assumed it would. Wait, I can... No. Alright. Here goes nothing. Wait. I need to get... Okay, so what flatten will do is it'll flatten out the land. It'll use whatever you put in here to flatten out the land. Uh, I'm going to use cobblestone, so I'm going to need to get a few more pieces of that. Unfortunately. Now I think... I think it's flattened. That I, I'm pretty sure I've used the right one. If not, it doesn't matter. The same effect will be achieved. We'll just have to find out. Uh, four stacks, that'll be enough. As I'm hoping it won't dig up the dirt and place down cobblestone. I just need something flat for now. 
So I'll make it look pretty later. I just, I just want a flat area. Yeah. I could do this manually. Yeah, but it's sort of not, you know, why have mods then? So we'll give it some power. And hopefully I've chosen the right one. Yep. There it goes. See what it's doing? Probably doesn't know what that is. But yeah. Okay, so it is flattening out. I guess they changed that. Or maybe I'm thinking of the... the building one. I don't know. But what I'm hoping it will do is sort of... dig out that stuff as well. Unless it, that has been changed because... I think that was going to be changed, but no, nah, there it goes. See, that's exactly what I want it to do. And yes, it's taking a little while because uh, now it's time to sort of explain the, the engine stuff. But you can see it's outputting one Minecraft jewel per tick. It has an internal buffer where it will store Minecraft jewels. And there's its heat. As it heats up, it can, it, it'll run faster. Like, uh, every time that moving bit touches, like, uh, goes to the end, it outputs the power. So if I can sort of watch it down there, and you see the stored energy just goes, just like that. And I'm not sure how much power this takes, but it takes a lot more than this. I'm just using this because we're starting early on. But coal coke as you can see, produces 16,000 EU per tick, whereas regular coal produces 8, I think. I think it's 8. I'm not sure. But it can also produce 6.4k heat. We'll talk about that later on when it's more relevant. But, uh, yeah. And uh, what this will do is just sort of dump all the blocks on the ground. But as the engine runs, it'll sort of get faster and faster and faster and it will it'll get rid of these blocks as well which I think is pretty key I think it's pretty key <laughs> yeah now what I can do actually is probably put dirt in here dig up this cobble is if you don't put building supplies in it, it doesn't start clearing off the land. Because what it does first is puts blocks down. So if you don't put anything in and it's not sort of digging out the area for you, that's the problem is it doesn't dig out the area until it's sort of built the base of it. <clears throat> Hopefully that makes sense. Pretty sure it does, but you never know. Yeah, as you can see, it's working a treat. Yeah. In uh, future versions, I have heard that it's not going to really drop the blocks for as long. Because what you could do is you could cheat quite drastically with this setup. I mean, I could take this down to the diamond level and just sort of build a little border and have it just dig out all the stuff for me and... Yeah, you know, that's but that's cheating. That's not what it was intended for, so I'm not gonna not gonna be doing that. But hopefully it's speeding up a bit. I might need a bit more coal coke in there, I don't know. I might as well go back and grab some. But that's pretty cool. Got ourselves a flattener and then we can start building stuff. That's what I want to do. Uh, where did I put the coal coke? There, yeah. Because when it's done flattening there, I... Mm, what do I want to do with it? That's a good question. Yeah, so once it's done flattening there, what I'll do is I'll... Dig up some basalt. Because I really like basalt. Basalt basalt, however you want to say it, I don't mind, 
Yeah, it's getting dark. I'll light up the area a bit. No surprises. I don't like surprises. Well, not deadly surprises. I don't mind real ones. Yeah. Oh, that's going to get destroyed. Yeah. Now we can stick that in. And as you can see, it takes quite a lot of power. And if I were using a better engine, or more of them, it would go a lot quicker. But I don't really want to build like 10 sterling engines because I'm not going to be needing them later on. So it seems a bit wasteful. I'm Shane. No, I mean. No, I mean. Yeah, no, I mean. No, I mean. Uh. Yeah. Yeah, that's what it does. How about that bronze pickaxe? What I'm going to do is mine out a lot of basalt because I want to build out of it. It's, uh, I think. Where'd I put it? I don't know. I found it. I'll put some stuff away that I don't need. Don't need you. Don't need. Yeah. Basalt, cobblestone. I'll put you in there. Sort of my fancy chest. <laughs> Leaf pile can go in the shit I don't need chest. How's getting that? I guess that can go in there. It's, I don't need that once again. Yes! Maha! I'm gonna go dig up a shimba shot, cabbage down. Should I even worry about it yet? I don't know. I don't know. I think I will. I don't know which one's faster. I think this one is by a lot. By a lot. Bit of a shame. Dig up. Ugh, I'm going to need so much of this stuff. It's going to take so long. Mm. You know what, I'm not going to record m myself picking up this basalt because it'll be boring and it will take up an entire episode in itself. So I'll be back once I've got... Uh, well, until my picks break. Let's say that. Yeah. Alright, um, I'm sort of a little bored of this. And I just thought, I reckon the filler might be about done by now. So, yes, do you want to go check it out? Yeah. Yeah, look, look how much I dug. Yeah, I did a good job. And it is done. I'll just run through and collect all the needless crap. Stuff like that. Yeah. Yeah. I'm hungry. I gotta stop sprinting everywhere. But oh well. Yes, this will be my work area. You can stop that. Yeah, I'll get you out of here. Alright. Yes, yeah, it's, it's pretty cute. Cool. It's pretty cute. Cool. Now, I'm pretty sure you can just break all this stuff with the pickaxe and. It'll give it all back. Because later on, there are some things that if you break with a pickaxe, they, um, it sort of destroys them. Like, uh, you won't get the actual block back that you broke. It'll be, a, like, a downgraded component of it. Uh, I'll try and avoid it. So hopefully I never actually have to show you what it is. But I'm really curious to see how much of a stack of this stuff cold coke will do. But yes, I want to cook up some basalt cobblestone to get regular basalt. And from there, I will make more awesome things. 
Yes. Uh, do, I, do I want more basalt? Mm. I don't know. I don't know. Clay. Yeah, I'll just do clay in here. Why not? Immediately. And apparent. Okay. And what I'll do. Ah, oh, that's cheating. I was gonna dig out the area with the filler, but that's not what it's meant for, so I'm not gonna do it. Uh, other things I won't be so strict on, but I just think that's... I don't know, it makes it too easy. It's like cheating. Like full-on cheating. But the reason I want basalt is because... Basalt brick. Hang on, what the shit was this? Basalt paver? Hmm. I'll have a look. The hell was the point of that? Yeah. Well, that's the reason I'm going to go with brick, is because not only does it look just Insanely badass. Once you break it, it actually gives you the brick back. So it's a. Uh, it's pretty much the same as a. Uh, bloody cobblestone. So yeah. I oh, know. I really don't want to wait for that. But, uh, let's go down and have a look. See. Yeah. Zombie. No, you're still in here. Good. <laughs> Zombie's just there somewhere. I don't know where. But, uh, find them later. It's getting dark again. Uh, I don't know. Oh, I want to. I don't know if I want it in the ground or sort of above it a little. Yeah, fuck, it can be above it. Already flattened out this place. Yeah. That is the start of what will become awesome. My sort of like factory house. Yeah. I don't know, I'll build a nice house over there somewhere. I don't know. Just away from the factory, like a holiday house. Her, her, her. Because, uh, you know, Minecraft is going to have his days off. But, uh, uh, I think that's, I think it's about time to sort of end the episode. I mean, eh, there's still a minute or two left, but I don't have much else to do. So we've got the land flattened, talked about how it works. I've shown you what I'm going to build the place out of. So tomorrow, we'll actually... What do you want? You want a blink? Okay. So what I could do is use the filler. Ah, that would be a good idea. That's actually a really good idea. I'll use the filler to build the thing. So look forward to that tomorrow. Hey. Um, I have been and still am the Inconvenient Panda. Thank you for watching and... End of video.